How is it going everybody? You're watching Then About Tech and today I'm going to teach you how you can do this. How you can easily remove any person, object or animal from your photos using the cleanup tool. Let's get started. Okay guys, so all you have to do is open up your photos and then on any photo that you have in your photo library, you're gonna tap here on this button at the bottom where you see little adjustments, tap on it, and then you're gonna see clean up. You're gonna tap on it and if you haven't used it before, it's the first time, or if you haven't used it in a while, you're gonna see something loading right here. So you have to wait a few seconds and then you're ready to use. If you don't see the cleanup icon at all, I'm gonna talk about in a second because you actually need to have Apple intelligence on your device. So we're gonna talk about that in a second, okay? So as you can see, your iPhone will automatically identify if there is any subject like object, a person or an animal that it thinks you may want to remove. It's done automatically, as you can see right here. So that's pure artificial intelligence. So if your iPhone automatically identifies exactly what you wanna remove, all you have to do is actually tap on this little highlight. So just tap on it, and then as you can see, wait a second, and then it'll do it automatically. As you can see, in this case, it removed the person, the little shadow, and of course, it completed everything that the person was blocking. So the little ropes, the ocean, the ground so it's absolutely perfect as you can see of course you can go ahead and tap on reset so it comes back because maybe you didn't like the results so you can do it all over again and of course you can also draw on your image if you want to remove something else or if you want to get more precision so you can go ahead here and draw on the image as you can see and then uh, it'll give you, in this case, the exact same result, but you got the idea. So you can either tap if there's something already highlighted or you can draw as you can see. And of course, the cleanup tool is very, very advanced. So for example, in this image, let's say I wanna remove just this, this electrical thing here on the coconut tree. It can, in fact, do that. So let's go ahead, tap on it. Let's tap on adjustments, tap on clean up. And as you can see, it didn't identify anything because there's nothing obvious on this image, but I can zoom in and I can actually draw on this little thing right here. Let it do its thing. Now it has identified and removed. I can zoom out, pinch out, and as you can see, it's perfect. So as you see, It'll do it for people, objects, and of course, animals as well. This is amazing. Now, if you don't see this button on your iPhone, it's because you don't have Apple intelligence enabled on your iPhone. Either because your iPhone is not compatible or because it's simply disabled on your iPhone. All you have to do is go ahead, go to settings, and then scroll down and tap on Apple Intelligence and Siri, and then of course, enable Apple Intelligence. If yours is disabled, you see a little toggle where you can tap on it and enable it. Of course, you only see this whole section, this whole section right here, if your iPhone is compatible with Apple Intelligence, so you will need an iPhone 15 Pro and up to use clean up and of course to use all of the other features of Apple intelligence. So 15 Pro and Pro Max and all of the iPhone 16 series, including the 16E, the entry level 16E. And by the way, Apple intelligence, of course, is way more than the cleanup tool. If you wanna see everything Apple intelligence can do on your iPhone, go ahead and tap right here or the link in the description. I have a full video on Apple intelligence waiting for you. Go ahead and check it out. I'm sure you're gonna love it. So thanks a lot for watching this video and I'll catch you on the next one. Bye-bye, guys.